Hey guys, how are you? Hope everyone's having a great day. It's a beautiful day here in Connecticut. It's just the way I like it. As you can see, it's uh, you know, just a little bit overcast. Not too much sun. Just a nice, crisp, cool day with a little bit of wind. I love it. So, um, as you can see here, I got eight boxes here and I got eight boxes in there. And the reason that they're two separate groups is because Amazon is now making people send media to at least two different other places, which really sucks. And uh, it didn't used to be that way. But recently what they did is they decided that, um, you know, let's make it a little bit more complicated for booksellers because they had it too easy, I guess. Um, trying to make more money, maybe. Uh, it kind of sucks. It really complicates things a bit. But, I mean, you know, it was too good to be true before because... Before, we could just send it to one place. They didn't split shipment on us or anything like that. Um, you know, you could just send all your media to one place, and that was fantastic. And the best part was, all my stuff was going to the closest warehouse, too. So I was getting, like, 20 cents a pound or something. I mean, it's just incredible. But the thing about this is, you know, I was, I was processing the books, and I was scanning them in, and I was like, oh, man, this will be great. Uh, you know, I got a whole bunch of books here. Let me, you know, send them in and make some money. And... I started to go through them and I started noticing that it was it was telling me to send it to another place and I was like oh man I don't want it to do that so you know I canceled that one sent uh, scanned it again and it you know got it to go to the other place and I was like alright that's better tried it again with another book and, and sent it to the same place again so I was like oh man what the hell and then uh, I come to find that it wants me to split every single you know every single time so I got uh, I think it's like 250 going to one place and 250 going to another place um, and it's, it's just a real pain in the ass, really. But, uh, you know, it just goes to show, it's like I've been saying all along, um, you know, in my most recent video, I was talking about it a little bit. It's like, you don't, um, if you know, if you don't make the rules, um, you don't, you don't get to, you know, you don't get to do things your way. It's, it's not, uh, it's not your selling platform. And they can change the rules as they go along. I mean, they can change stuff up on you. In this case, it's kind of a, a wrench in the cogs doing this, but I mean, is it is it still worth selling on Amazon FBA? Of course. Is it still worth selling books Amazon FBA? Of course. Um, but you know, things can happen. The shipping cost to, to go into into uh, Amazon to the warehouse that could change. You know, UPS could have uh, have an issue with them. They might go on strike. I mean, you just never know. There's so many different factors. There's so many different factors. Uh, and, you know, maybe they can renegotiate the contract and maybe the price of sending stuff into Amazon will double. I don't know. I mean, you just never know. There's so many factors and you can't control any of them. Uh, just to give you an example, one of the ways you can control shipping things, I mean, if you're sending out heavy stuff on eBay or Amazon for that matter or anything else, you know, um, if you ship out stuff that's only super lightweight, like uh, little paper items, that's a good way to control it. Better way to control it, though, is to, to have your own website and to have different income streams, which is another thing that I wanted to talk about today. And basically, it was just, um, you know, like I was talking about in the video with uh, Rake and Profit. We were talking about different income streams. And, um, you know, I'm working on my blog a little bit at pickingprofitsblog.com. If you haven't been, check it out. I'm working on my website, which I'm hoping to release. I was going to release it, like, maybe today or yesterday. Um, I'm hoping to have it up by Monday. You know, I'm going to work real hard on it, finish it up. And, of course, you know, I can always change things as I go along and, you know, uh, listen to what people have to say about it and take their input for it. So uh, maybe it'll be like a beta type of launch. I don't know. But I'm really excited about it. I think it's going to be a fantastic new website. And I think it's going to offer a lot of good information for you people and, I think people are going to like it, but we'll we'll see, you know. Ultimately, if you don't like the website, you don't have to go to it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm really excited about all of that. And, you know, it's just, I was thinking about what kind of ads to run on it, and I was like, you know, it's really tough to, to find, like, good stuff to market because there's just so many scams out there. And if you look on Amazon, um, there's so many different products that you could, you know, that people that people need. And I was like, well, all right, I'm just going to promote stuff that I use on Amazon. And, uh, you know, if you click the link, of course, then it's my affiliate link, so I make some money. But uh, 
it's it's you know good stuff stuff that I use so uh, I feel good about marketing items that I use and really just promoting those types of items services and such so on my website you know I'm not gonna have like click here and make a million dollars some little scam link um, I was looking at affiliate programs I could join and I, I, I could not find a legitimate thing to advertise that wasn't just like scam 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 so it was just interesting um, kind of kind of ridiculous I know there are different programs out there um, you know some of them I gotta go direct to the person um, but I was looking into some like uh, maybe worth point or something like that I've really been meaning to look into into worth point as well as Terapeak because they are really good services I've just never used them but uh, you know we'll see I'm just I'm just really excited for the future and um, fourth quarter sales I mean even third quarter you know I mean sales are picking up for me big time I don't know about you guys I know you know with textbooks and all people are people are really with <laughs> I guess either the students or the uh, or the desperate parents uh, are out there buying the textbooks so I, I noticed a big uptick in sales and you know uh, with this fourth quarter if it keeps going um, like it was last year I'm gonna be double I mean I've pretty much been double all of last year for for everything so oh man it's just it's uh it's just so great to watch all the hard work really start to pay off and the other thing is as you know since I sell so many books and that's that's really uh, the majority of my inventory the, you know you put in the time now and it just pays off for like the next three or four years so stuff I did last year is now like ripe and getting picked it's like um, you know it's like planting a fruit tree almost it's like um, you know it takes a little while but it just keeps building and it just keeps building and building and building and the return on investment you know it's just uh, it's just simple math so can't say enough good things about books and and used media uh, but hopefully you know I've got really good big plans and um, gonna be coming out with some really really uh, important ebooks that uh, people have been begging me to make I get so many freaking questions and I'm glad that I do it's just I don't have you know, I haven't I haven't written the book. I haven't written the guide. I, and I and to answer every single person individually, I, I've I've been doing it, and it's been taking up so much time. I could have just written an ebook by now and and said, here you go. But uh, you know, this this coming next year is just going to be amazing. It's going to be absolutely epic. And you know, seeing as this is a vlog, and uh, I have my blog. It, that's what it is, you know, it's reality. It's not fake. It's not some scripted BS. It's not, uh, you know, no one's paying me, telling me what to say. I, uh, you know, I don't have, I don't have an opinion that's been purchased to, to tell me to say certain things and to not say certain things. And that's why I think people really connect with my, my YouTube channel and my blog and my Facebook because it's, it's reality. You know, it's, it's, it's reality. It's a real entrepreneur who, who loves what he does and there's no BS about it. And there's so many people on YouTube who are, you know, there are a lot of scammers and fake people on YouTube, but there's also a lot of really great people. And uh, one of the things I've noticed that has been really fantastic recently is the Wednesday night meet and greet. It's just, it's just so great. Um, tons and tons of people on there. And uh, it's just, I mean, man, the YouTube community for reselling. Um, it's, just, it's just really great to see so many people get together. Uh, and of course... You know, if, if you've been watching me, you should know that's on Golden Finger Picker's channel. And uh, he's a nice guy, too. So you should certainly check him out. And anyone else that's on the meet and greet hangouts, because they're all really great people. So um, I've got really big plans for YouTube. I've got really big plans for the website, for the blog, and for so much more. And uh, next year is really going to be, I mean, coming up soon. It's just going to get better and better and better. I've got so much stuff planned I want to do, you know, what would be really great is if I could do like a, like a series, just make like, a, make like a show, just completely real, no BS, no planted items, you know, nothing fake like that. So I'm really excited for that and I hope you guys are too. Hope your sales are doing great, hope you're really putting in the time and working hard because right now is when you got to get hustling in there and get all that freaking stuff sent out to Amazon FBA or listed on eBay or whatever you're doing doesn't matter what it is or what it is or how you're doing it you know now's the time to uh, really put in that time so 
Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, hopefully this video helps to inspire you to get out there and get going. You know, um, this should be, uh, I think it was about 9K gross worth of books. So, you know, that's, that's the initial estimate. Obviously, prices go up and down from there. It takes a long time to get that money back. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go bring it over to UPS now. So, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. As always, if you're watching this for the first time, hit that subscribe button so you can get more videos when I make them. And, of course, make sure to go to my Facebook at Pig and Profits. Thanks, guys, for watching, and I'll talk to you later.